We're going to be taking a look at the TI champions. I'm very excited for this one. If you're just hunting Miro around, you're actually playing his game. You're doing exactly what he wants you to. Right. Uh, and they are trying to put that counter pressure back onto Collapse and now have the dust available. Is actually up top. They take down TSA and trying to find a bit of a counter kill here onto Collapse. Need to be careful though. Ah, the caustic damage. Trying to bring down Lightless. A couple more punches and Collapse will live through it. They don't get the kill. Oh, the dust were off. Oh, oh no. Absolutely. A hell of a start and showing some of the danger of like running into that creep wave with Caustic available is up top. Ghost Stick keeps on taking the punches. A nightmare from TSA, but they need to take these bugs off. Oh, good save. Ghost Stick should be able to get out of there. Maposhka dive Maposhka? in behind tower looking for a finish. Ghost Stick ends up living just barely. Not a ton of regen left in this lane. Yeah, it would be perfect for Collapse to fight around the creeps, right? And he's doing that now. Mm. Uh, nice fortification, though. Yeah, well played, well played. Sandstorm still going. Do they have anything else for the kill? One more punch, they get him. Not bad, not Wasn't... bad. Yeah, really well played by Empire. At the same time, the Collapse, he had sticks on one second of a cooldown. Same goes for Burrow Strike, so he couldn't really uh, catch Ooh. anyone. But Ira <laughs> oh, jumps in for the snipe. Nicely played by that Monkey King. Nothing for free in this one, Nick Hillary, on this Disruptor, Again, but they're oh. chasing in. And TSA will get Astral, so dodges the EMP, so no regen of mana there for Toronto Tokyo. TSA will eventually likely get killed off. Yeah, he's done. But nice Iceberg bird. makes the move afterwards. Wants to find a kill, misses on the Remnant, but the chase down is at least enough from Aposhka. You can use it offensively, but defensively is just as uh, important. Right, and because of that, you can't continue an iceberg. But mid lane again, they keep it moving. TSA doesn't have six yet. Iceberg still playing with fire, might get burned as tries to cut the tree. Not gonna happen. They kill him off. Iceberg gets taken down now. Round two. Oh, the combo does he hit both of them? Meteor hammer onto both drops the ulti afterwards. Toronto Tokyo trying to play his way out of this has the ghost walk out and can pop it at any point. He's just trying to bait him a bit further forward. And no detection. no detection. I like the Monkey King as an answer for the OD, though. Just to have that Boundless Strike to break a Meteor Hammer. Yeah, I agree. And uh, his positioning so far has been on point. Is there a glimpse on Invoker mid lane? Yeah, there is. Looks like it. Into the Remnant afterwards. Still no level 6 on Bane, but it doesn't look like they're going to need it. Double Dust for double the fun. Static Storm down. Wanted to get the last little hit on to Toronto Tokyo. And it looks like they will right there with the Dissimilate. Harry won't get brought down by Maposhka. Well, will they mount the full offensive play? Team Spirit, they no longer keep that like heavy pressure mid. Instead, TSA gonna get caught here by Maposhka in just a moment. They got the bugs on him, and eventually we'll find that quick pick. Wait, is there something happening from uh, Empire here? It oh, it's could Spirit be. And Disruptor. Yeah. Oh, they have a feeling that they know who is here. And if they can kill Yitaro, that would be huge. Looking for the jump, tries to get him, pulls him back into that static storm. And with only a Battle Fury done, this is a huge kill. Now, can they get out afterwards? Going to use the glimpse to get Toronto Tokyo away. Mira tries to jump in, looking for Iceberg. He used both of his Astral Steps, though. And, well, it looks like with the Burrow Strike in, they'll get a little bit of recompense as Iceberg is brought down. But still, taking down that PA, high priority kill. Usually from CIS teams, yeah. there's always a couple. <laughs> like... oh, they get try two, though, this time. Iceberg, oh, the Nightmare safe! Tries to Astral get out of there. They've got the bug on him, though. Iceberg in some trouble, manages to back out, and they actually are going to find the return kill on him, Maposhka, instead. Oh, where's the voice lines? They spammed them all last time. They're not getting, like, completely blown out. Like, a 3k gold lead at this point is, is big, but it's not insurmountable, it feels like. Yeah, it's not a huge lead at all, and yeah. they might even catch a Weaver here. There is Sand King waiting, though. Yeah, they caught Maposhka, and yeah, he is going to go down. Sand King, collapse, TP's nah. out. Going to be fine. Yeah, he he was thinking about helping uh, the Weaver, but there is no helping him. There is, the only thing that can happen is he goes oh, no. in and then he feeds too. Oh, this can't happen though. You can't lose Lightless like that. That is a big kill. Nicely played by Team Spirit. Right. Like, because of the OD. And this hero is pretty much useless as the BKBs are on. He can save his allies, but that's, that's it. Invoke Scott. Trying to find. 
They drop it down. Finds the kill almost. Oh, gets killed off. Got him. Nice finish there. And Mira on the other side getting ran down by Legolas. Suddenly, this is looking okay. Although, they take down the Bane and the Disruptor. And Yotaro trying to finish off Iceberg, who will have another Resident Pulse, but it won't be enough to keep him alive. Poshka scouting. How are you in the area as well? Reveals Ups. himself. Jump in and... Static Storm down. Can they find anything else here? Oh, the Spirit Vessel in the end is going to be enough for the finish. Meanwhile, they get the grip. Going to be broken immediately by that Cold Snap. Man, when it rains, it pours. They are getting completely demolished. Pulled apart. Suddenly, all of Team Spirit are up top. And they kill him off. Took a good fight. It's also that that position happens to be around the Rosh Pit. So now this might be another smoke. Or will they just play around the T PA? Oh, they see Lightless? this. They see this. Oh, Lightless. Careful, careful. Jump in. Gets taunted. And there we go. The turnaround potential. But Lightless pops me. It gets eliminated by Yotaro. Oh, that was the quickest BKB into death that I've seen in a while. TSA drops as well. Yeah, that if one hurts. If she sees you, you're most likely dead even in your base. You know that there's a Monkey King probably on the trees. Oh, okay. Astral, Astral. Now the jump, Ghost Stick saves himself yet again. The Static Storm is still down. This is a pretty good one. And they drop the ulti afterwards. PA dead once, can they do it again? They lost their OD. Empire, gotta grip. be careful the grip from far away. TSA has to back out. Itaro turns, oh. wants to hit. Another kinetic field down. Itaro looking like he's gonna be fine. With no OD and no OD ulti, they aren't going to be able to get another great fight, but they, at the very least, might be able to survive with the racks. No, the jump in comes. BKB afterwards from Lightless, but they chase him down. Try and find the kill. Good Glimmer Cape. Keep it alive for the moment. And oh, the Sun Strike Bad takes sun down strike. Kaori. Oh, nowhere is safe. And now they can back off. Oh, collapse. So, yeah, just <laughs> having fun with it. At this point, I think he's doing it on purpose. Yeah, that's fair. Uh, Iceberg uh, gives him the tip afterwards. Lifeless. <laughs> Walks in again. Iceberg finds Maposhka. Can they do anything here? They blow him up. Not bad. Naitaro BKB out. TSA already dead. Do they have any extra control? Good save coming from the OD. Yutaro BKB wearing out. They want to keep this chase on, but a great tornado is going to stop it from coming any further. Although the taunt afterwards, the rest of the team hasn't quite caught up yet. Another Astral comes through. Yeah, is there another smoke perhaps for uh, Lightless and the boys? There is. It's on TSA. And they might. Yeah, they instantly pop it. No time to wait because they don't know Rush hasn't spawned, mm. right? They show themselves now, though, and Lightless finds one. There's a great kill to get. Maposhka dead again. Buys back immediately afterwards. Meteor Hammer down as well as the Sack Storm. But Toronto Tokyo, you're always going to get that BKB off. They at least baited out of him, but can they kite any further forward? Keeping OD alive, Astral and himself. Or he keeps on backing up, but no stack storm. And there's the jump in round two. They find collapse. That's a huge kill. Lightless has the MKB for this one. And now with two dead for a very long time and maybe finding a third. Oh, Invoker, no BKB. Where is it at? Toronto Tokyo goes down as well. Lightless with the triple kill and Roche is about to respawn. Asleep up on the high ground, but they miss... The remnant afterwards from Iceberg. Lightless trying to take this down. They still have Epicenter available. Collapse my jump in. Static Storm. Oh, that's a good play. That's a really good play. Boundless Strike once again. But the Meteor Hammer and the Taunt. They catch for the kill. They take down Mira. Sick stuff. Iceberg. Round two. Oh. Collapse. A little bit of a swing and a whiff. Toronto Tokyo's back. He's pissed. Wants to find a kill here. But Iceberg him. is going to get brought down. Things are getting very weird as they jump in. Kill off. Also the Disruptor. And looking like Bane's going to fall as well. So they get the Aegis. But Yutaro gets a triple kill in level 25. The Void Spirits right now. And can you even defend? That's the ah, question. That, I mean, it's Seems a tough one. There's the jump. They got... No, we missed out the save. Oh, no. The misclick. OD not able to do it. They lose the Aegis. Lightless has to be so careful. A bash on the dagger. The, the Dota gods want Team Spirit to win, and Lightless Where did he go? exploded. Oh my god. Unbelievable. Mira's there. 
Spots a couple. Ghost Stick's a great first one to get, but they're going to go on the Disruptor. Dust, Yules, BKB out. Now trying to turn and fight onto this one if they can. That's a lot of cleave damage coming in. Oh. One hit for the double. Oh, one hit, two kills. Yataro with a freaking sniper. And GG is called as Team Spirit take the game in the end. Pretty stuff. Yeah, they got them fountain diving a little bit, but I don't know. Team Spirit, they just have this button that they can press to just overclock themselves pretty much. They had that Team Spirit magic with them. And uh, when they're playing like that, you have no chance. Gets denied by the clap and one hit. Top lane. Oh, the impale. He sh still should be going down. Yeah, go stick. Chases in and will be able to get a return kill. Maposhka finds the finish there. They're not showing anywhere on the map, so he's quick enough to blink out. Well, uh... Lifeless. Moving in. Trying to do what damage they can. Wants to find a Nightmare and an Impale. Do they kill off Toronto Tokyo? Then for a couple more punches and a stun afterwards on the Iceberg. Lightless still living through it. Misses the Sonic Wave, but still gets the double kill. And now Lightless in some trouble as Yataro makes the rotation. They find that kill on TB. As Mira, maybe also in some trouble here as TSA trying to chase him down. Does have another Impale. <laughs> Don't know if that was a miss or a... It still has a 15 stick. Should be okay. Mm -hmm. I, I was thinking he might go in. Yep, he goes in. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, not like this. Taro, the slowdown, tries to back out. No mana left, Iceberg. Oh, not like this. This is going to get dropped. And TSA also in some trouble. The Spike Carapace will try and buy a little bit of extra time, but it's not going to happen. And suddenly it's eight minutes and a 3,000 gold lead. You don't necessarily want to be stuck in the triangle already. Your best bet, perhaps, would be to move slowly towards top. Uh, collapse. Looking for it. Spike Carapace. Connects down to... Oh, no. Oh, no. Not like this. Stun afterwards. Can they get in range? They don't have another Dragon Tail, but they just dropped the ulti. Blow up TSA. And now Iceberg trying to get out, but they have vision. Oh, no, they don't. That's a radius they don't, they entry. Don't. Yeah. So the back away. Iceberg looking kind of okay, but they're going to lose Kyori, so... Oh, man. Where there's one hero, there's many. Who can they find? Harry has that level six. Nightmare to start. And it looks like Maposhka is going to be the one that is left behind for dead. So, Queen of Pain. Oh, no. Iceberg. In some trouble. Sonic Wave. Doesn't have the mana. Oh, the cogs broke the mana for Blink. Oh, no. Iceberg. It was a wave. But then the stun comes out in the kill. With the regen rune too, man. And it helps out versus DK. It's the perfect item. It's just that it looks a little bit weird to go Yasha Dragonland straight into straight into that Skadi. Hook shot after the fact. TSA in a little bit of trouble now. Impaled to try and buy a little bit of space. Iceberg will have that Sonic Wave available. But gets caught and now oh no! They get the Meteor Hammer after the fact. Nightmare save. Good dodge away, but the Hex comes out afterwards. Maposhka on the job, and Yutaro finds the finish. Just going to try and get out of here, but no such luck. Collapse takes down Lightless to boot. The BKB reveal, and Team Spirit just layering those stuns perfectly. Empire, they just got caught. <laughs> well, uh, Team Spirit, you know, at the very least, they're going to see, hey... There are uh, snakes in here. They were doing this, and then the smoke came afterwards. I think that there was a ping. Spots everybody. Looks out. BKB. Great reaction. Afterwards, BKB from Yutaro. Need to try and kite this one away if possible. Hookshot comes in afterwards. Hex, lightless turn. Turned for the kill. Oh, but the Glimmer Cave keeping him alive. Yutaro will eventually fall. Now the turn's around Tokyo. Stun. Sunder already used. They need a way to save this TB. Taking too much damage. Collapse was there and now sticking around for more. TSA, good impale. Iceberg hoping to find something here, but the hex is out. And then the stun and then the jump forward. Nothing doing for Empire as the triple kill comes from Collapse. And it might even be an ultra here as the Bat Rider also soon to die. Poor Empire and Team Spirit. Just too freaking strong. The moment Shadow Shaman gets his claws on top of Terrorblade and he can't really move, he can't yeah. hit anything, it's over. But um, they reacted really well to the smoke.
I think it's a bit of a BM. Top there lane. might be. Whoop. Oh no, Iceberg caught and most likely gonna be killed as they got the hex afterwards. Ghostick trying to stop the pain, but there is no stop as Ghostick oh. gets turned on now too. You're running into wards, my friend. Gotta be careful. Wants to run away and also a fight going on the other side. Kaori gets chased down by Razor. That's a death. Oh, and they spot Ghostick now too. He's, he's there's nowhere left to go, my buddy. No blink dagger and no firefly and mira is there as the chase will come wait a minute yeah jump forward stun comes out shackles afterwards dead done mm. collapse mm. kills off tsa yeah the game is well and truly off the rails now yeah interesting like most of the games that i have followed and watched on razor is is the refresher orb it right. just feels so good after falcon blade and bkb obviously right well go stick bkb Hoping to find something. Manta to dodge it. The pushback. Iceberg. Hex afterwards. Mira taking a lot of damage from these TB illusions. Nightmare afterwards keeps Iceberg from getting completely obliterated. And actually the Scotty doing some decent work. But with an Astral afterwards, another Astral. They've got Sanity's Eclipse up in 30 again. Meteor Hammer drop not quite on the mark. Oh, but it did Niposhka. hit the rain tracks. Oh my god, Maposhka, what are you doing? He was crazy. a little bit, just a little bit too deep. They still have 30 seconds on the ages, though. Yeah, some more time. Iceberg. This could be interesting. Oh my god. Oh my god. What? Again, I think that they got spotted. Yeah, that smoke. They are, they have a really good ward here, though. Look at Taro. Looking for a jump, maybe. Again, he's got that BKB ready. Taro jumps in. Iceberg gonna get caught, Toronto Tokyo found the stun, and Mira now with the Cogs pushback. There's another round of the Banish though, and OD has Sanity's back up in 20 seconds. Toronto Tokyo chased down, the Sunder is there. He's gotta be careful, Lightless getting slowed, OD on the far side, looking for the chase, and well, with Sanity's back up in just a couple of seconds, Lightless is gonna die no matter what, doesn't even need it. Looking for more, Kyori likely to fall, although does manage to get the save there by TSA buyback comes from the clockwork and team spirit they take down three but in the meantime you know the the big story it feels like is that team spirit they don't need that much to get huge and well bkb the turn and now the hook shot comes through onto two razor is very low and looking like he is going to try and get out of there the jump away comes collapse blink backs also Mira still living through all of this and waiting for that Sanity's Eclipse to come out. Round two blows them all up. Not bad at all. Lightless trying to back out. A hell of a lot of damage. Toronto Tokyo finally going to pop that BKB. There's the stun. They got the shackles. Everybody's dying. Empire going to drop and GG is finally called. The pain can end. Is Team Spirit going to take this one 2-0?